Good morning. Welcome to this Ice Age booster box. We are down to pack number 14 today. Um, these are all Jester's Cap artwork packs. There's 36 of them in the box. Um, you can check out our previous videos to see what we've pulled so far. We're looking for snow covered lands. We're looking for Jester's Cap, obviously. And we'd like to hit a Necropotence or some Brain Geysers. Something pretty iconic and nostalgic for 1995 Magic the Gathering. We have this 1996 price guide as well. And that's going to tell us what these cards were trading for with, right after they were released. And um, it's been kind of interesting. We're comparing them to the prices on TCG Player today in 2023, 28 years later, to see if they... Uh, have gone up or down in value. Some have gone up quite significantly and most have gone down though, true, unfortunately. So, Death Ward is the first card. It was reprinted from ABU. These are all the commons. We have Morphine. We'll see. Some of them are playable in Ice Age formats. This is 10 cents, so not playable. It's a 3-3 Swamp Walk creature for three colorless and a black. There's a counterspell, that is awesome. That is the Ice Age counterspell art by L.A. Williams. She is counterspelling somebody's spell. Um, we'll punch this into TCG player and see what we get. $2, 15 cents, that's been a hit. Anything above a dollar is, is awesome. So that's counterspell. We have pretty good, pretty good return on the investment there. We have Balduvian Bears, 2-2 two, two Bear by Quentin Hoover. We have Essence Filter, which we've seen before. Destroys all enchantments or destroys non-white enchantments. We have Arctic Foxes. I really like the art there by Mark Poole. That's a beautiful fox in the snow with the birch trees in the back, and it looks almost like, you know, the purple island art as well in the very distant background. And if defending player controls any snow-covered lands, no creature with power greater than one may be assigned to block Arctic foxes. Um, in 1996, foxes was a 40 cent card right out of the pack. And we'll just check in 2023 TCG player to see it is down to 13 cents, so yeah. No price movement on Arctic Foxes. Gaze of Pain is pretty common. I have several copies of this card. Uh, for each creature you control that attacks and is not blocked, you may choose to have it deal no damage to defending player this turn. Not sure why you would do that, but um, Cloak of Confusion. I have not seen this card in many, many years. It is awesome art there by Margaret Organ Keen. For a colorless and a black, you enchant a creature and if target creature you control attacks and is not blocked, you may choose to have it deal no damage to defending player this turn. If you do so, that player may discard a card at random from his or her hand. Um, ignore this ability if that player has no cards in hand. Um, we'll just see if that ability is worth anything. 28 years later, 14 cents, so no, but gotta appreciate that art. That is just amazing artwork from Margaret there. She still does conventions, so if you wanna get cards signed by her, I encourage you to collect her cards and go find her at a, a, an event and um, contribute to her magic cards. We have um, seen this one before as well. It's Ar Orange Lots Ascent. It has a cumulative upkeep of one blue. It's an angel creature by it's an enchantment, but it's like an angel, angel looking figure on there by Drew Tucker. We have Wooly Mammoths by Dan Frazier. Love this card. Uh, it is a mammoth. It gains trample, trample as long as you control snow covered lands. Um, we'll see if the mammoths, I know with Elephant Graveyard, mammoths can be good. We'll see if um, 17 cents TCG player does not think they're 
outrageously expensive. And then we have Word of Undoing that we've seen before. Christopher Rush art that is, and there's, this is the rare, we'll flip over to the uncommons. Fanatical Fever we've seen before. Our 96 price guide says it was a $3.50 card. We'll go to TCG Player. 20 cents for Fanatical Fever, great. Um, we have Sodeldi, uh, Sodevi Machinist by Jeff Mangus. He's got some sort of voltaic key in his hand and it adds two colors mana to your mana pool. Um, let's see here, we'll go 96 first. Looks like 250 back in the day. Uh, in 2023, today's price, 21 cents, not bad. Looks like so far all the um, commons have been 10 cents, uncommons around 25 cents. The rares are anywhere between 10 and three, four dollars. Demonic Consultation is actually one of the best uncommons in the set. This is a, a, a great card for one black, it's an instant. You name a card, remove the top six cards from your library from the game, and reveal the next card to all players. If this card, if it is the card named, you put it into your hand. If not, you remove that card from the game and continue revealing the top card of your library and removing it from the game until the named card appears. So you basically just get to tutor for the card you named, but you have to mill a bunch of cards that are not that card. So if there's one card you need in your deck, you could play Demonic Consultation and go for it. Uh, let's see, this was a $3 card back in the day, 1996. And we'll just find out what it has gone up to. And $15 and one cent. So, so far, this has been the most expensive card we've pulled out of this Ice Age box. It's definitely hit at the uncommon slot. Uh, and the rare of the pack, let's see what we get. Maybe we get uh, Necropotence in the same pack. I'm not sure, but uh, we get Formation. So $15 card here. That's pretty awesome. Put that there. Uh, formation is an instant. Target creature gains banding until the end of turn. I think that is not going to be the best, um, the best rare. Let's see. In 96, this was probably a couple bucks. $8. So in 96, this was worth more than Demonic Consultation. And we will see what formation looks like in 2023. Uh, here we go. $1.14, so not exactly a super rare, but um, definitely the best pack we've had so far. So we've got Demonic Consultation and Counterspell. I would call that an awesome pack. Uh, we'll make a quick uh, thumbnail for the viewers. We'll upload this video. Um, we appreciate anyone who subscribes to the channel. If you wanna see the rest of this pack, be, the, the box being opened, we're gonna open up all of these packs until we get to 1,000 subscribers and then open up the starter deck. So awesome. Demonic Consultation. You could counterspell the Demonic Consultation so they don't tutor for the card they're needing, but these two cards are definitely playable and in amazing condition. So uh, thanks everyone for watching. Have a great day. Catch you in the next video.